Okay, so we are in Bali, Indonesia at the moment. Today I'm just going to walk around and try and interview a few people, ask them how long they've been here, what they're doing here, and yeah, what their agenda is in Bali. So let's get on with it. Let's go. All right, so how long have you been in Bali for? I've uh, been here about five months. Five months? Yeah. All right, so you're living here? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm uh, for at least another year and a half, or a year, maybe. All right. Yeah. So what made you leave Australia? Uh, I'm get. I sold my house. I'm getting a house built. Right. And um, to rent a house in Perth is ridiculous. Right. So by the time I paid rent and bills and whatnot, I'm gonna be going backwards. It's cheaper to come here. So I might as well go backwards here. Yeah. And I'll go backwards at a much slower rate. All right. You know? Yeah. So but, what area are you staying in? You're staying in Kuda Legian area. Or? Yeah. At the moment we're in Kuda, but we just bought a house in Jimbaran. All right. And I hope uh, you just leased it. No, no, we bought it freehold. <laughs> How? My Who's wife's name? my wife's Indonesian. Oh right, all right, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Same with mine. All right. Oh, okay. I was just gonna warn you on the the risks of buying in someone's name, but if you're married then it's fine. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. you know. Well that's good, you can get a permanent visa easy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've already got the Kitsa visa. A so. kit us. Kit us, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you've obviously been here many, many times. Eh? Yeah, I've been coming here for about 17 years. 17 years, yeah. 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 And where's your wife from? She's in the uh, Yeah, Yes, uh, Sulawesi. Oh, Sulawesi. Yeah. Same with mine, Makassar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I've been to Makassar. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Where's your wife? Manado or Makassar? Or, Central? Um, Taraja. Oh, Taraja. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, no. yeah. She's Christian, my yeah, wife. Right. Yeah, right. So, All right. Yeah. So, yeah, so no, we went over very strange over there. Yeah. Everyone, the bull eye. Because they've never seen a bull eye. Yeah, right, Kids yeah. are coming up to you and, what's this, you know? They think you look like a monkey, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So what do you think about, you've obviously oh, been here before COVID and yeah. now afterwards. What do you think about the prices and that are things at the moment in Bali? Uh, prices have definitely gone up. Definitely. Um, without a doubt. Um, yeah. If, but yeah because i live here now it doesn't really affect me because we eat at home yeah and yeah. i only go out like i'm going to go to the grand final today right. um, but I, i'm not a big drinker yeah right. so because of that it doesn't really affect me but i have noticed like with friends coming over the price of hotels definitely everything has yeah. gone up Since and COVID, the quality it's definitely doubled everything at least and, and the quality seems to have gone down as well right in my opinion like of the food, like All I'm right. a pretty fussy eater. Hey, thanks for your time, mate. No worries, mate. All right. Cheers. So, how long have you been in Bali? Seven, it's my eighth night today. Eighth night today? Yes. And where are you from? From Sydney. Sydney, <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah, Sydney. What area in Sydney? Sutherland Shire. Sutherland. Yeah, I was born in the Sutherland Shire. All oh, right. there you go. See, I was just talking to a Cronulla guy a minute ago. Oh, how yeah. funny. All right. So, how long are you going to spend so in Bali? So, the kids and I are now going to Noosa Lombong. Oh, Lombongan. For right. three nights, right. and then we fly back. Right, it's good over there. Have you been to Lombongan no, before? Never, never. You really like it I over there. Wait. It's good. <laughs> There's no traffic. <laughs> so. Amazing. So how many times have you been to Bali it's before? It's my second time. So I'm here with the two teenage kids and it's been great for me. It's great. really good for a single mum. All right. It's excellent. That's good. So you just let your kids do their own thing? Yeah. Or, yeah. So are you doing any other tours while you were here? Um, or? The kids went to Waterbomb. We're doing a tour tomorrow to like snorkeling. Oh, it's not going to go well, over in La Bonga. Yes. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a whole day thing. To see the manta rays and all that. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. Over on Nusa Panuda, that'll be. Yeah, yeah that's exactly where. Yeah. Yep. All right. So that'll be really fun. Anyway, well, have a good holiday Thank and you. thanks for your time. <laughs> Thank you. Thank See you. you later. Yeah. How long have you been in Bali? This is our second, yeah, third day. Third day? Yeah. So you've been to Bali before? Uh, this is our 19th time. 19th time? Yeah. <laughs> so when was Bali's it? like our second home. Right. Like most Australians, I suppose, yeah. yeah. Um, when was the first time that you come to Bali? Uh, 1984. 1984. It was very good back in the 80s, wasn't it? It was. It was fantastic. This was this nothing, trees exactly. And, you know, bamboo, warrens, yeah. and... And yes. only a couple of handfuls of hotels, and that was about it. So what do you think about Bali in general at the moment? Um, look, do, I do think, think the progress is great. It's making it a little bit more accessible for people. It's easier to walk on the beaches. Um, the bar area's been cleaned up. The beaches are basically cleaned every second this day. This time of the year they are. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's fairly safe on the streets, so... Yeah, so you feel yeah. safe here? You've oh, never, yeah. Never had any dramas here or no, anything? No, never. Never. Right. It's all been good. All right. And uh, how long are you staying for this time? Uh, two weeks. Two weeks, right? Yeah. 
So, where are you from in Australia? Uh, Cronulla. Cronulla? All yeah. right. I was <coughs> born in Engadine, actually. Oh, well, there you go. Sire boy. I yeah. Suppose. Yeah, so while you've been here, what have you been doing? Just hanging around this area? Or are you oh, yeah. doing you any just, tours? Or? No, no, I'm I'm all toured out. Yeah, uh, toured out. <laughs> yeah, that's the only issue here. It's the uh, uh, transport. The traffic, too. <laughs> yeah, the traffic is ridiculous. You know, like, if you want to go somewhere, there's two or three hours of your day taken up. Yeah. Whereas you could be doing Plus, something else. Plus, you've been here 19 times, you've seen it all before. Yeah, exactly. Right. I, don't, I don't want to sit in a, in a cab or a or a uh, car for four or five hours yeah. a day. So you might as just come to here to relax and relax, do yeah. nothing? I've got my favourite restaurants. I know a few people on the beach. Yeah. I know a couple of guys at Sonora own pubs. So we just go around, visit. and. Right. Yeah, so what relax. do you think about the the price of things especially after covid Did, um, can you dramatically notice a difference of yeah, price increase it, it has increased but not to the extent that you know we're at australian prices it's, it's still yeah. an affordable holiday if you compare it it's still cheap yeah well but, if you go to the high class restaurants of course you're going to pay top dollar yeah, yeah. right like in seminac places like that but if you go some of the smaller rooms yeah you're getting your money's worth it's yeah, very cheap enough. still cheap all right, anyway, thanks right. for your time, mate. No worries. All right. You're living in Bali at the living moment? Living in Bali for right. 10 years. 10 years, all right. Yeah, yeah. And so, uh, what area are you living I in? I live in Legian. In Legian, yeah. all right. And what made you move to Bali? We've been coming here for 30 years. Right. Prior to moving here. I guess I had a midlife crisis. Got a job over here, originally. Right. Um, I'm a chef. All right. So, um, I was cooking in the Waiba. All right, the one, yeah, yeah, I know Steve, he's yeah, one of my mates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. and um, yeah, I just have been here ever since, but now I'm over 60, you're not allowed to work in Indonesia. Oh, if you're on the you retirement purchase, visa, all right. Unless you purchase a PT company, and right. it's too hard when yeah. you're my age. All right, and uh, so you're planning on living here like the rest of your life? Well, I've you think, got or? a 25 year lease on my villa, right. so yeah, well, at least the next 25 years for yeah. sure, unless something happens. <laughs> well, you've normally got options to lease again, haven't you? Or? Yeah, yeah, I can yeah. re-lease it again. But so did you lease the land and build that, or are you just, no, just, just leasing? No, i leasing it right. from the owner. So since you were here before COVID, yeah? Yeah. So since COVID, what do you think of Bali and the prices and do you, can you notice the difference? Yeah, I can. Where the rest of the world rode off two years. Right. Right. Bali was really, it was really quiet right. and yeah, there was nothing happening. But they are trying to make up that two years. So yes, they have bumped up the, the prices way I look for at it. everything. Some of these five star things, uh, hotels along the beach were like, 400,000 a night uh, d during the COVID and yeah, at the end and now yeah. they're yeah. 3 million a night. That's right, that's <laughs> so, right. But it's I, I suppose everywhere in the world it has increased but I've noticed it here dramatically in the tourist area. Um, I'd say prices have doubled and tripled for food oh, and stuff like most that. Most definitely. Yeah. I don't know how it's going to do. The new Prime Minister comes in 31st of October I think. Oh, right here, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So he's already been elected, but... Yeah, yeah, he's been yeah. elected, but I think he takes office the 31st of October. Yeah, I'm not sure what he wants to do, but we'll see. Jokowi was good. What do you think of Jokowi? Oh, um, you're not really right. into the I'm politics really of it all? I'm not really into the politics. Yeah. He was okay. I saw him a couple of times when he came here, like, right. you know, I'm walking the dog and, and his little right. cavalcades. But okay. Thanks to... Uh, thanks for... There you go. Boys, uh, how long have you been in Bali already? Uh, been in Bali. Four days. Four days? Yeah, yeah. Alright. And uh, how long are you here for? I'd say 12 days. Like, 12 days? Yeah, yeah. So what are you doing? Party? Yeah, yeah. Not so far. We're out one night. So where have you been out? Where did you go party? Something like food or? Uh, we went lots of dollars. Right. And then from there, we went to Mexico. Oh, Mexico. Yeah. Right. And then after that, we went to San Juan. We were almost half a day. Is this your first time in Bali? First. First time? Yeah. First time? Ah, so you were like taking him with yeah. it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And uh, what do you think of it so far? Yeah, it's pretty good to get away from like Melbourne, Australia. Yeah, right. And they're 
the whole lot. Yeah. So get out, it's pretty nice. So this is the first time you've traveled this time. Alright. Well you've got the travel bug now, so that's it. You're right. That's it. Alright boys anyway. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Yeah.